Hey, what is up everybody? It's Timo here. In today's video, we're gonna be playing on a new Broken Fighter build that I myself has recently come out with. So, I'm pretty sure there is not a single soul in this world that have come up with anything close. This is legit my personal build that I've personally created. There is not a single player that ever played with the build that I'm gonna show you. So, if you ever come across this, this is gonna be, you can call it officially, that's Timo's build. So, before you get to the video, I want to remind you, only 28.4% of people who are watching my channel have subscribed, the rest didn't. Consider to press the subscribe button if you're interested in a variety of uh, broken builds, broken videos, or dark and darker. This is what I'm going to make in the near future, and I'm not going to change that for quite a while. But, let's go back into today's video. So, this is what we have. We have a crystal sword on a fighter. And if you want to use a crystal sword on a fast fighter, you gotta have a weapon mastery. And once you have weapon mastery, well, you will be able to use the crystal sword. Simple as that. And if you want to make the crystal sword slightly stronger, it, well, just throw a sword mastery. And if you want to make your fa fighter to be slightly faster, throw on swift. And if you want to be a little more tankier, throw on defense mastery. Combination of both will make you fast, tanky, and you're gonna have a decent chunk of physical damage reduction. If you build a decent amount of action speed, your fighter will feel like a rogue, but with a crystal sword that will be able to do additional magical damage. Well, that's basically kind of sums it all up. Oh, by the way, we have a windless crossbow that, um, you know, does a decent amount of damage and also have armor pen. And we have another windless crossbow. And we have another windless crossbow. And another. And maybe one more. But I'm not exactly sure if we're going to use every single one of them, but we're going to put some effort and we're going to try to use them anyway. Ideally, ideally, we get to use every single one of them. And if we don't, you know, if you wouldn't need them, or if in case if we run out of space, we're just simply going to throw them mainly, mainly due to the reason that the windless crossbow on the market, purple quality, only goes for 70 freaking gold. Yep, that's the price. Basically, the windless crossbow costs nothing, but if you land that one good shot, you pretty much could kill anybody. You know, the windless crossbow just really slaps. And uh, it all depends whether you're lucky enough to land a headshot or a body shot will get the job done just as well. For the rings, we're going to be using something with additional magical and action speed because we're trying to buff crystal sword. I do believe additional magical damage we're going to stuck to magical weapon damage that you have on your crystal sword. And that magical weapon damage is going to be boosted by the will. Currently, we have 49 magic powers. So pretty much the number here is going to be buffed by that. So which is going to be pretty good. And then if you want to attack faster, well, you can throw a little bit of dexterity so that you will be able to swing that bitch a little faster, which, you know, going to make it a little stronger. So pretty much, yeah. Basically, you are a regular longsword fighter with the only difference you have a crystal sword instead. And you're kind of building will instead of dexterity or, you know, the uh, other attributes. So yeah, I think I think I've kind of summed it all up. And yeah, remember, this is my personal build. There is nobody that ever has ever touched this or played on this build before. This is Demo's build. Uh, sorry. <laughs> no, I, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Honestly, I've been requested already like fucking 25 times over to make a crystal sword build. And uh, the time has come. We're going to be playing with it a little bit. Legit, this build is strong. I'm not trolling you. I'm not going to fucking, you know, say it's not. This build is really fucking strong. But, um, you know, you just gotta fucking put some effort to make it work. It's not that build that will be, you know, just like you, where you will be able to just double it here. First, you have to land one of these. Maybe you might as well throw a survival bow. You know, it's definitely gonna help. But um, realistically, you don't need more than two windless windlesses. And, um, you know, two windlesses is all pretty much you would need. Or like two windless crossbow, the fuck it's called. I don't know, but it's not that deep. Anyway... We're gonna hop in the game, we're gonna go clap some chicks, hopefully we'll catch some good fish today, and uh, yeah, let's get to it. By the way, there's one thing that I was requested, and that is to include a buying process. So this is what we're gonna do. I sold a couple of gold bags, and now we have extra cheese, so now we can go ahead and buy some stuff. Basically, you wouldn't really need more than 4,000 gold, but, um, you know, you can... Pretty much spend up to 20,000 gold for this build in particular, but uh, 4k is pretty much all you need. After playing for quite a while, there is one piece in particular that will make this build a lot more effective, and that is the Fine Keras. Even though I roll with the Templar, if you want a more efficiency and um, overall more attributes, more stats to your build, go with Fine Keras. Templar isn't it, but... Um, 
it's fine still, you know what I mean. Okay, speaking of a Templar, I found one with two Wigger, one Agility, very cheap, very cost effective. Speaking of leather gloves, we're gonna look for some with action, with health or Wigger. Basically, we're just looking for the um, cheapest attributes that will benefit us one way or another. Something with additional physical damage definitely gonna slap. Armor pen only for 300 gold. Here we go. Boom. We have that. Okie dokie. Heavy boots. You're looking for move speed. Strength, power, magic power. The cheapest piece with one of those attributes gonna be handy. As long as those are the attributes that will, you know, go directly toward your um, stats that are using, that's when the build is going to be useful. I mean, that's when those stats are going to be useful. Just have one of those, like either action, either max health, wigger, strength, PDR, does not matter. Pretty much at the end of the day, it's if you be slightly stronger or slightly weaker, it's really not going to make that much difference because the core of the build kind of remains the same. Sometimes there have been occasions when I build it, the exact same build was way too much action speed and it was fucking uncomfortable to swing that crystal sword. The quick attacks were so quick that it legit made it feel like you're attacking with the Castilian or something. Like, something is going on with the range when you have too much attack speed. Like, your attacks just doesn't hit. So, it's not always ideal, but maybe it's just me. I don't know, maybe I'm just uh, not used to the crystal sword. But anyway. As for the Grim Smileys, you're looking for the ones with action speed and additional magical damage. They will not go for more than four to 600 gold. And usually, that's the um, medium range you're gonna, you know, find them at. Bear Pendant, very cheap, additional magical action, ideally we get all three attributes, here we go, we got three magic power on top, so far so good, we're actually kind of still at budget, have a lot of stats, so yeah, gotta get a crystal sword with additional weapon damage, maybe a little bit of extra health, holy fuck, those are expensive, <laughs> okay, well, let me see, maybe magic power, yeah, those, yeah, this one, this one looks pretty decent, 250 gold, here we go, boom, we have it. And that, that's kind of sums it all up, that's pretty much the whole build. You might as well throw a survival bow if you're interested, or windlass. It's all good, so it's all up to you. I usually just run with windlass, but sometimes you can bait people to think that you have a survival bow, you switch up to windlass crossbow, you land one shot, you get them off guard. This tech in particular will work very well against good players, but um, against bad players or, you know, people without much experience, they wouldn't care what you have, they simply will double UK, and if they get lucky enough, they could fucking kill you. So, but yeah, like, basically... You could kind of control or you kind of see what a professional player going to do. Because like, you know, you pull out the windlass, he'll try to dodge, dodge. But um, a player who doesn't know what you're doing, he, like he just, you know, focus on one aspect. Like get close and clap your cheeks. <laughs> so you know what I mean. It's... But anyway, windlasses are good. And that's what we're going to use in today's video. This lobby legit feels like fucking some craziest lobby ever, Nagali. Holy fuck. <laughs> I feel like I'm the least geared homie in this lobby, Nagali. Gotta be careful. What is this homie fucking doing? Stop! So, we have a super geared warlock, super geared rogue, a geared ranger, and a geared bard. Beautiful. Fucking beautiful game for a warm-up. <laughs> By the way, I brought in two windless, and um, also I brought in survival bow, just in case. Survival bow may be actually pretty good against good players, but, uh, you know, with windlasses, yeah, you can actually get people off guard. So yeah, I haven't truly really decided how am I gonna play. Okay, so we have a naked homie 
who is fucking on my dick. <laughs> I don't want to kill him. I've checked south so far. This homie came from the east. So if anything, we gotta check north and we gotta check west. And I would assume we're gonna come across scared players. As long as I don't get landmine, I'll fucking help. By a rope, I should be fine. I pull a fighter, kill two players. Pull a fighter? Very familiar nickname, by the way. I think I already killed this guy a couple of times. But it's been a minute ago. I pull a fighter. Hmm. Fucking heard this name somewhere. Something off with my settings. Legit. Everything is so sharp. It's legit. Doesn't feel right. Oh, here we go. Oh, shit. I had DLS. Oh, finally. Holy cow. My eyes. <laughs> I'm back to life now. The game was fucking straight up lagging and that didn't feel right. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have a fucking rogue somewhere here. Looks like we are on someone's dick. Oh, holy fucking shit, bro. <laughs> okay, we have a door open to the right. Oh, door open to the left. Hmm. Okay, let's use a bot just in case. Gotta have it prepared. Okay. Looks like we have someone here. The mob is dead. There is no rogue or traps here. You have a duo fighting here. Looks like two noobs wanna fight each other. I'm not gonna interfere. Let them mind their own business. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, we have a guy here. It was bold of me to assume that he would duck left. <laughs> Gotta heal up. Let's see if he's gonna try and push me. I could try and use um, invisible potion. Probably should have brought five windlasses. <laughs> that would be so handy. Yeah, looks like someone's on me. Probably the bard. Nah, I fucked up big time. He doesn't want to fight me, what the fuck? One, two, three. I hit his arms. Four, five, headshot. I fucking barrel, I missed. That missed somehow too. Yeah, I gotta work on my windless crossbow shots. I think he's super low, I think he's like 1 HP. He reacted like he's fucking inch away from dying. Oh shit, I got a hit. He could technically one-shot me right away here, but uh... Okay, that was hit. That was obvious miss. Oh well. Now fast enough to catch up to a homie. It is what it is, we'll fight again some other time. Let's just reset, get our HP back. That's hella dark here. Alright, let's pre-pod. The homie could be hiding somewhere. Gotta be careful here. Hmm, the fuck is that? No way, did the homie use the extract thing? That probably the case here. The homie probably is gone. Oh, no, nope, he's not gone. Oh shit, we have a homie right here. Mm, my position isn't very good for oh, a piece of shit. <laughs> I 
Yeah, his position is legit better here. Ow, you piece of shit. Fucking hurts. Okay. Alright, so let's do what? Let's go reset my windless crossbow. Come back, try to hit him. It's like basically... I run out of red pots. You fucking kidding me. Well, first game, it is what it is. Where did I throw my fucking windless crossbow, bro? What the fuck is this? I had to. Oh. Okay. He didn't try to duck. Aww. He fucked up. Homie died. Homie died. What the fuck? He decided to drink a potion be behind the door while I'm directly W King at him? That shit doesn't make any sense. Holy fuck, the true plus max health. Those two drinks, by the way, is my whole gear set. Oh shit. Yeah, the homie came in prepared. Apollo fighter? Does Apollo player and fighter? <laughs> I thought he only plays trios. Yeah, no, if he's uh, playing in solos on a fighter, you could actually see it. The homie doesn't really play that much solos. We have someone. Yeah, we have someone fucking behind. Oh, shit, the homie stepped in the truck. Right. Oh, man, out of all classes, it has to be a warlock. Shit. He's super low. He's like fucking 50 HP max. Fuck. Okay. Nice duck. Yeah, nah, it's fine. I run out of arrows. But I already have a good gear set. But holy fuck, I feel like this warlock was so low on HP. But um, I'm just full on gear. This gear set is, I would assume, around 15,000 gold, more or less. So yeah, we're just gonna take it and get out. Yeah, that's pretty good. Holy fuck, some of those pieces are insane, by the way. I could believe that that's actually Apollo, because you can bring stuff like that. If you play trios, you get access to the best stuff quite easily. Oh, by the way, if you're curious how much damage does this thing does, here we go. It's okay. <laughs> it's fucking horrible. If I hurry up right now, I will end up in a troll's room and uh, I will be able to... What the fuck? I got like 15 messages in my Discord. Someone is trolling me big time. Hold on a minute. How did this homie end up here? Huh? There is a spawn that close? That was a little too close. I gotta see where he fucking came from. Because that was just weird, I would say. Did he came from the mid room, I would assume? But he also cleared those mobs to my right. Have a little bit of true. Oh shit, those are pretty good, by the way. Oh fuck, his whole gear set is pretty good, by the way. Yeah, no, his whole set is actually a decent replacement. No cap here. Mm, good, okay. Where the fuck this homie came from? Okay. Well, listen. I wasn't the one. <laughs> okay. The thing is, I spawned to my left. We got one player l literally running at me. And we got another player. There's like four players in the lobby. How do they fucking all end up in the same spot? <laughs> I thought I wouldn't even come across anyone. It was fucking a dead lobby. What the heck? It's like the game decided to send everybody in one place to fight right away. <laughs> mm, I'm not really interested in fighting anyone. I'm good on loot. Might as well extract. And I don't really want to kill anybody, honestly. Might as well mess with this guy a little. Oh, this guy knows how to block doors. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. It's okay. We'll just extract and go into the next one. 
No. Into the next game we go. Mobs are cleared out here. Interesting. Oh shit, we have someone opened the chest. Oh, he's in the water. <laughs> I'm sorry, brother. Uh, fucking damn me after the game. Or if you watch this video, I'll give you something. <laughs> I know this guy is new. Like, yeah, I just fucking couldn't not do it. You know what I mean? <laughs> no, no, no. Trust me, I never kill new players. I legit never kill new players. <laughs> Uh, other than this time, listen, other than with the win less crossbow, because it was just, uh, I cannot not do it, you know what I mean? <laughs> oh, fuck me, I'm sorry. Usually you're gonna come across, usually you're gonna come across people in the mid room, and, um, looks like I got right in time. If anything. Okay, that's actually interesting. I think that's already a dead rancher. Damn. Oh, the mobs locked the doorway and he died. GG. Well, it's gonna be like that sometimes. He was chasing the rogue. There was uh, three very good players in the lobby. I probably should have just let him chase that rogue till forever or something, but I guess fuck it. Rogues are my biggest fucking counter. Like, this is not a bar dish. Actually, with this build, I'm fucking scared of rogues. But at the same time, I've noticed that um, with this build, you actually do pretty well against bards. And um, you do pretty well against... Uh, I don't even know what you do good with. It just... It works pretty well against certain weapons. Like, it works pretty well against rapier. And... Um, but it doesn't work well against stiletto. This is what I noticed. Okay, bunch of true. Oh shit, okay. Yeah, the homie have like fucking 3k in his inventory. Not bad, we take that. Alright, let's use the potion before we call the elevator. Because um, that troke that was, um, you know, being chased by a ranger. It could be fucking somewhere creeping around. I got ambushed so fucking many times by rogues, it's fucking ridiculous. What the fuck, bro? He was sitting fucking legit somewhere. What is he fucking playing with? Is he playing with my build? <laughs> the homie is playing with my fucking build, bro. Oh my god. Yeah, no, he, he is like Demo. Yeah, he, he fucking... The homie knows. The homie knows. Fucking eat that. I don't want to fucking fight rogues. I'm, I'm genuinely good on that. If anything, I just want to extract and go next game. I'm also kind of good on gear. And always fucking lose against rogues. <laughs> they always fucking manage to land mine. Fuck them rogues. Nah, the homie not wanna let me go. Oh shit, I hit him toes a little. He does possess a lot of threat, by the way. If anything. I whiffed through his. Okay, he's like one shot. Oh. I am... I'm good, bro. <laughs> How did he fucking dug that, bro? That was insane. Nah, he fucking deserved to fucking survive, bro. Fucking... Most... Perfected timing. Legit. It's fucking ridiculous. Hmm. Interesting. Looks like someone was here. We kinda gotta be careful. I'm not gonna lie. Hope I don't get fucking ambushed here. <laughs> And I could imagine bear dropping on my head right now. That'd be fucking hilarious. Okay, so we have a barb. Is one body shot? That's 
<laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh fuck, I know why it was just... Um... <laughs> it was like in fucking cartoon, you know what I mean? It's hilarious. Well, now we have a um, ranger to fuck with, so gotta be kind of careful. want to make sure that I have all my windless crossbows reloaded. Yeah, it's actually kind of cancer. You might as well get them windlesses. They only go so... Oh. Ah, oh, shit. Where did the homie go? What the fuck? Huh, he probably went... Hmm, I don't even know. Homie fucking disappeared. Oh my god. <laughs> Another homie. Oh yeah, he did not like that. <laughs> okay, this one has an arm. Bro, they're all so good at fucking dodging stuff. Holy cow. Gotta try and blast him a little. Oh yeah, that definitely hurt. He's probably like half HP. It's a little shot. Oh, did I miss? Wow. Yeah, sometimes it's gonna be like that. What is the homie doing? Is he trying to block me? Oh, I think he dies in one hit. Yeah, he's probably gonna die like right here. Oh no, he could actually get on the other side. Oh no, never mind, he dies here. GG. I just got DM'd. Go to prison room to fight me. <laughs> so yeah, no, I just came to prison room, but um, there was no one here. So I don't even know what the fuck is going on here. Oh shit, there's a fucking ranger, bro. <laughs> Fucking late night gameplay. Can see shit. Oh fuck! Right in the face. I'm surprised how he's still alive. Oh wait, there's another home. He's so zoned in. Ah, never mind. He's gone. Oh yeah, that did damage. Oh no, the homie stepped in a trap. It's my time to step in a trap now. Wait, he stepped in two traps? Haha, <laughs> I expected that he's gonna duck, so I would make sure that I hit. It's like, you go for a head and fucking always miss. This is what I noticed. Everybody is like good enough to just go and duck. So you cannot really never aim for a head, you know. So I did type the homie that um where he is at, but um I don't know. Maybe he's in this here somewhere. That's kinda weird. The homie said come fight me at prison and fucking he's nowhere to be seen. Interesting. Alright. I kinda gotta be careful here. There is one rogue who was very aggressive towards me. He was legit interested to clap my cheeks. I mean in fact he could actually, it's not that hard. Crystal Sword, fucking, I know, I whiffed so many hits with Crystal Sword already, it's ridiculous, especially against other rogues. What the fuck is going on here? Barb? And the rogue? And the bard? Man, what the fuck is that shit? I thought I would fight one of them, bro. I want to kill this bard. 
That's so weird. It's okay though. Oh well. I mean, if I start attacking one of them, I'm gonna die. I don't want that. Oh well. The door is open here. Oh, looks like someone died here. Oh, shrine is taken. Oh, here we go. We have a bear. Perfect target, by the way. Beautiful target practice. Ah, imagine if I get him. It's okay, I could tank some hits. By the way, he hit my arm, and that's actually really good, because he could have hit my fucking head. And we're just gonna hit him once at a time. And one more. GG. Let's see what the homie has. Holy hell. Super juicy. I see ruby silver. I know it's fucking best. I would have to fucking throw 300 gold and win losses. <laughs> oh well, it is what it is. This gear set's gonna fucking pay off a lot more. Realistically, four windlasses is like bringing in four purple axes. <laughs> Same price, by the way. He killed somebody, by the way. Let's see. Oh, here we go. I was wondering if there is another corpse that I haven't seen. Oh, holy hell, those. Oh, shit, dog. That's pretty good, man. You gotta have those. Oh, yeah, true damage rings. Yeah. They're pretty. Right here. Oh shit, most with physical. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's like fucking 3k. <laughs> oh, Kidoki. Gotta be careful here. I agreed with one guy that we're gonna meet in the middle and we'll fight each other. But um, there was like a whole lobby who was legit interested to fucking kill me in the pre lobby. Oh, I think that's the guy, by the way. Is that the guy? Or it's the fucking angry rope? No, I think this one is a friendly. Hello, hello. Alright, brother. Oh my god. We fight. <laughs> okay, okay. Is, are you fighting somebody else right now? No, no, I'm just chilling here. Was actually waiting for someone to fight. Okay, how do you want to do this? Do you want to start on both sides? So um... I feel like the moment we start fighting, there's gonna be that fucking rogue who's gonna try and third party us or some shit. So if anything, we gotta go somewhere, you know, where it could be uh, fair for both parties. Okay. Okay. Let's go okay. all the I way. Think the I think place. let's go east all the way to the extract. Yeah, this okay. is the homie. This is the cool guy. We're gonna have a little fair fight with him. Oh, that's crazy. I've, I've been in multiple of your games. Yeah. Every time I try to find you, <laughs> I can never find you. I came across you three times, bro. What do you mean? <laughs> have you? Yeah. I, mean, I think... I remember I th you did kill me when I was like, holy gold. I seen your nickname like three times and then, like, the thing is... Oh, wait. The, um, the... Uh, oh, shit, there is a guy. I'll fight him. No, no, no teaming, brother. No teaming. We're 1v1. I mean, I'm not gonna interfere. Just heal up, yo. Go heal up. Go use that shrine. Use that shrine. Yeah, listen. Listen, use that shrine right here. I'm not gonna attack you. I We just wanted to have a fair fight. Go use the shrine, dog. Like, we're not gonna attack you. We we legit wanted to get here to just fight 1v1, you know? So without third party. So go use that heal shrine. Yeah. So if you want, you could just... And then skedaddle, after... Uh... Skedaddle once. <laughs> No, 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 uh, heal up and then we can 1v1 or you can 1v1 rogue or something. Listen, we came across, we'll just make it fair without third fighting and then, you know, you'll decide. Yeah. Do you want to fight? Do you want to fight too? Or do you want to, or do you want to just... Oh. Alright, let's fight, let's fight. Hey, let's, listen, it's time. It's time, oh, okay. <laughs> it's... I guess... <laughs> I thought he would fight him? I thought he would want to fight me? What the... That's so weird. Okay, fuck it. Let's fight. I don't know, dude. I don't know, man. I, I thought so we. How should we do this? 
just go that direction and then w once we come across each other we fight simple as that just we start here i start here we fight that's all good luck brother okay i have a plenty of um crossbows in an open fight i think i'm gonna stand the chance but um this is actually a pretty good position for me to fight him with oh i hit his toes Oh, that fucking hurts a lot, by the way. Oh my god. Yeah, here's one more shot. GG, Britta. Alright, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take all the stuff and I'm gonna give it back to homie. He want to have a little bit of fair fight and I respect that. It's something that usually you don't come across that often. It's fucking extremely fucking rare, in fact. And also he was super friendly throughout the whole interaction, so I think... It's very well deserved gear setback, so I'm gonna give it all to him. So yeah, let's just go to extract and let's give the homie his stuff. What the fuck? <laughs> How does he know? How did he know that I was here? Yo, bro, I didn't make a step. I legit was fucking sitting in that corner for like five minutes waiting to extract. That was so fucking weird. Holy cow. Hello. <laughs> just fight a guy. I'm just trying to extract bread there. I'm trying to get the kit of the rogue that I killed. And I wanted to bring him his stuff back, that's all. Deadass watch your videos every fucking day, that's sick as fuck. Really? <laughs> I, do, I didn't know it was you. I, I oh. looked at the kill feed and I saw it was your fucking name. I was like, oh my. <laughs> no fucking way. Why you guys didn't kill me? Oh, oh I didn't want to kill because I, I, I know it would be unfair. I came across homie and he was like, yo, let's go fight somewhere. And I was like, bet. I was like, there is a rogue who wanted to team up on me, you know, in the pre lobby. And I was like, listen, how about we go fight somewhere private? You know, and usually in this place right here, there is not that many people. So, you know, we ended up coming back all the way here. <laughs> and then we came across you. And we came across, I'm like, bro. No, no, no. No, no, no. I was like, we're not, no, no, no. I told him, listen, you know, <laughs> we fight, we fight one v one fair. We're not going to, you know, do any BS. You know what I mean? Oh, it's for the meme, for the meme. Legit, just for me, yeah. It was a pleasure to see you, brother. All right, I'll catch you later. Okay. Let's go to the trolls room really quick. And if we're not gonna find anyone there, um, we'll go to the mid room. Oh, looks like someone is fighting them up there. That's nice. That's an interesting build. He has halberd. Also, he has five souls, looks like. So he's probably either demon form or BOC guy. I respect that. That's pretty sick. Okay. Ah, <laughs> I missed. Oh well. I mean, bro, he asked for it, didn't he? He was like, let's one year one. Sure. Who am I to say no? You know. What pants are those? They look so pretty, by the way. They look kind of blue. Like, pretty blue, you know what I mean. Okay. Gotta make sure that I have my bows ready. Okie dokie. Is he gonna turn into demon form? Oh yeah, he's doing it. Let's run away for a little bit. I could stab him one time too. And we're gonna go back to the shrine. And by the time he gets, I will be able to kill up here. 
And I'm full HP. Quite convenient. Okay. <laughs> Bro, he jumped over it. He got the skill. Yeah, the homie is goaded. <laughs> he has a legendary fucking halberd. It looks really pretty. It's like, it has the colors of a legendary item, you know what I mean? Bitch. <laughs> oh, we have another guy here. No! A fighter was Bardish. That's my build, bro. <laughs> that guy fucking is my direct counter. Fucking. Oh. Three. Oh, he died. Choo -choo. I don't think I stand a single chance against this guy was British. Like, zero chances. Because he will just kill me in two, three hits. He has higher range. Yeah, no, he's just... Where the fucking corpse go, bro? Not here. I don't see any pots. What the fuck? Huh. Yo, did he jump all the way down? Holy cow. What the? You know what? Let's open up the door just in case. And now we can look. Fuck me. I'm so dead. <laughs> no, I'm not dead. Ow. Jesus Christ. Could I kill him in three hits? I'm curious. Question is, can he kill me in three hits or no? One. You fucking kidding me. <laughs> you killed me. It's your build. Yes, I know. It's my build. Bitch, he's... Bro, I... Th fuck, I thought he's running second win. He also does... Um, you fucking kidding me, bro. What the fuck is that, bro? <laughs> I got owned by my own build. GG, brother.